He just threw a firearm. Get on the ground. Get on the ground right now. Now to a story you'll see only on six. A takedown caught on camera. The arrest stemming from a social media dispute that turned dangerous. You've heard the warning about not letting things on Facebook and Twitter get out of control, but police say that's exactly what happened here. NBC6 investigator Willard Shepard has the exclusive details. He just threw a firearm. With sirens wailing, police rushed to corner 23-year-old Samuel Kontorowski. He's wanted for allegedly planning to kill his rival. Police say when the man he had been arguing with, Joseph Barrios, came out in front of his North Miami Dade home late one night, Kontorowski drove by and started shooting at Barrios, the sparks flying. Barrios told officers the bullets were whizzing by, but he didn't run, staring down the man he was feuding with. It was several weeks later when North Miami police officers were chasing an armed Kontorowski through a park and cemetery. On the ground! I will! Get on the ground! Down! Jeez. Down! Down! Don't move! Put him back! Don't move! Put him on your back right now! Hours later, he was in bond court. You're being charged with... Um, premeditated attempted murder. The judge um, reviewing the last Twitter exchange between the two men. Barrios writing, stop direct messaging me, you nerd, bum. And his rival saying, Chico, I'll put the pistol at your face again and you'll drive back home. Pull up to my girl's crib and I'll shoot you with hella chops. Try me. Kontorowski finally ran out of gas when running from police. Oh, I know you're good. I was dead tired, man. Kiss off, I was dead tired, man. Kiss off, I was in custody. Get you in. Woo! You've been begging to get up. Now we're trying to get you up. Hold on to him. He a flight risk. You was running 100 miles an hour. The judge worried that the feud, which played out on social media, has come to this. I'm concerned for the safety of the public, um, given the indiscriminate shooting. Kontorowski has entered a not guilty plea to the charges, and he's being held without bond on a warrant from Georgia over at the Miami-Dade County lockup. We went to speak to Barrios Monday about all of this, but no one answered the door at his residence. Willard Shepard, NBC6 News.